Hi, this is Joanne Marcinek of Ask Joanne LLC. Welcome to my very first screencast. This screencast is going to cover how to create a blog. The first step when creating a free blog at www.blogger.com is to sign in with your Google account, which is usually just an email account that you use to consolidate any of your services that you have with Google. Blogger.com is a Google service and so you can log in with that account. If you don't have a Google account, the sign up steps will lead you through how to create one. We're going to start by clicking Create Your Blog Now. Okay, to create a Google account, all you need to do is enter in an email address that you want to use a password, the display name, the word verification to let them know you're a human being and not a machine, accept the terms of service, and click continue. The title of my blog is going to be Become a Blogger. You can title your blog anything you like. What you type in here for the blog address is going to be the address that you send people to when you want them to go read your blog. You get to choose this, the name before the blogspot.com. For example, my business blog is askjoanne.blogspot.com. You can click to check of it availability tells me this blog address is available and I'm going to click continue. Next you get to choose a template for your blog to decide what you'd like it to look like. Most of my blogs are use the minima template just simply because it's clean and wide open but depending on the look and feel that you like you can choose any of the pre-existing templates that they have here. For this example I am going to choose scribe continue. The blog has been created. The next step is to create your first post. From a search engine marketing standpoint, if you're using your blog for business purposes, you want to put in the title of every blog post the key words that you'd like that post to be found for on the internet. Now considering the fact that there are millions of bloggers and billions and billions of pages on the internet, your single blog post for a specific topic is not very likely to be found. However, it's always a good idea to put in the appropriate keywords so that if your post has just exactly what someone is looking for and they type those keywords into the search engine, your blog post may come up. So I'm going to label mine how to become a blogger. Blogging is easy and fun. Blogging allows you to create a web page as easily as writing an email. You can insert hyperlinks if you'd like to link to another spot on the web. You can insert pictures. You can change the formatting by clicking on these tabs up here to change the way the blog post looks. You can preview what the blog post will look like. And then when you're ready, you just click Publish Post. I'm going to open this blog in a new window. Voila! This is what my new blog looks like. Blog posts are arranged in reverse date order. So when I post a new post, it will come up above the June 1st date. There's lots of other things that you can do with your blog, adding ads to the sidebar, adding links to the sidebar, um, having people subscribe to your blog by using the RSS feeder that's built into it. But basically, these are the steps on how to create a blog. 
When you want to edit your blog, you go back to www.blogger.com, log in with the address that you created associated with this blog, and then just start posting. Create as many posts as you like about as many topics as you like. This is the quickest, easiest way to get information out there on the net. Another really cool thing about blogs is, is that people can comment on your blog. You can choose to turn commenting off, but if you want to create the blog for an open discussion amongst people, it's always a good idea to leave the comments on. Well, that's it. How to become a blogger. If you have any questions at all about this screencast, please contact me at info at askjoanne.com or by phone, area code 203-364-0222. My website address again is askjoanne.com. You can sign up for my free newsletter or get all kinds of useful information on how to do search engine optimization and get better visibility for your website on the search engines. Thanks for listening and have a great day.